Welcome back here with us on Times Now. Viewers, the historic moment is finally here. After nine long months in space, space heroes Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore are finally going to return to Earth. It's a 17-hour long journey from space back to the Earth and there were some emotional moments in the space station. Can you imagine what it has been like being in space for so long? What it would have really been for both these astronauts? astronauts what was scheduled to be just a 9 day stay extended to 9 months due to technical difficulties well there has been lot of uncertainties and anxieties but it's all set to be a thing of the past because today the descent to earth has begun yes in just few hours from now the two astronauts will finally be back into their homes will be back on earth two steps of the four step process in fact have been completed already so what are the processes that have been completed and what will happen in the next few hours let's break it down for you nasa has confirmed the hatch closure and undocking process at 8:45 a.m. indian standard time the astronauts seal the hatch separating them from the iss now this is the first important step that marks the beginning of their departure it went on smoothly and cheers filled the air as the two astronauts bid farewell to their home for 9 long months and after the hatch closure the dragon spacecraft detached from the international space station at uh, 10:35 am indian standard time and this is the official step for the descent to earth take a look at the moment when sunita williams and butch wilmore said goodbye to their home for 9 months and you see at the hatchway the uh, four departing crew 9 crew members posing for some final photos and nick hag aboard freedom confirming that dragon's hatch to the international space station is closed looking uh, once again inside dragon uh, butch wilmore on the left settling into his seat as the commander of dragon veteran NASA astronaut Nick Hague on the far right of your screen Sonny Williams Roscosmos cosmonaut Alexander Gorbanov is completing a, a few uh, adjustments uh, to uh, items uh, with his seat he will uh, don his entry uh, suit uh, just a few moments from now and all four crew members will be positioned ready for undocking and uh, the beginning of a 17 hour trip back to earth and a conclusion to this mission go ahead on two uh, we are on in step 5 with the smoke too and we found some uh, pieces of dust around the hatch seal area so we are going to clean them with uh, carton tape copy and concur with the plan The uh, hatch uh, between uh, the International Space Station and pressurized mating adapter number 2 is now closed. The Dragon hatch was closed at 10:05 p.m. Central Time, 11:05 p.m. Eastern Time. Now the question is what comes next? Well, later tonight at an estimated time of about 2:15 a.m., the Dragon spacecraft will embark on a series of intricate maneuvers. The next step is D orbit burn which will take place at supersonic speeds before finally slowing down its speed to re-enter earth's atmosphere so after so many months and a harrowing yet an important learning experience these two astronauts will finally be in earth's atmosphere once back in the earth sphere at around 3:27 am indian standard time the dragon spacecraft will splash down in the atlantic ocean off the coast of florida and with parachutes the two astronauts will finally be back on earth after months and months of no gravity they will keep their feet on earth and this will mark the end of the space journey but of course the 9 months in space have been very very eventful and we'll of course be live with all the latest updates so don't forget to watch times now for uh, how this uh, much anticipated and exciting journey to earth happens tonight with this we will slip into a very very short break more news and updates on the other side stay with us